I'm here in Middleton on the main street at Murphy's Butchers, and I'm here with Frank Murphy and his son, Brian. So the whole thing is the back leg of the animal. So we have to break it down. We seam out this muscle, mm -hmm. which is on the inside of the animal, a lot more tender because it does less work. We call this the knuckle. It's just another part of the, the animal. And what we have here then is the silver side. How long ago did you start? My father came to town in 1948 and he bought these premises. It was a butcher shop at that stage and it was owned by another Murphy who had three generations of Murphys in the shop. When my father took it over, when he retired, I carried it on. And now I'm about to retire and my son Brian is there. Thank goodness Brian so, is involved. <laughs> so please God, um, it'll stay alive. Do you always know that you were going to become involved as you were in school and growing up? Well, when I was growing up, I wasn't quite sure what I was going to do. And I went to college and studied culinary arts. So I was kind of cooking this up with what my first passion was. And then I went traveling. And when I came back right. traveling, I just kind of, I just kind of fell into the family business and I just started walking away and then I kind of grew a passion for it and it's handy with the culinary arts falls into it like you know so you've the knowledge of food already absolutely so, um, so here we are now at 15 16 years later we're so lucky to have you at Ballymaloo and at the cookery school as our butcher because you also have your own abattoir that's correct which yeah. is getting rarer yeah cattle sheep and pigs so we cover the full range. It's in the centre of town too, only walking distance from me here. And I remember years ago yes. seeing you walking across, sometimes even <laughs> cycling, yeah. I think with half oh, a yeah. lamb you on your back. Walking <laughs> yes. across town. They're what it is. They're what it is. <laughs> because we rear our own beef Stop, yeah. at the yeah. school and then it goes to you, yeah. to the yeah. abattoir. Yes. And then you deliver it back out again. Back to us. Yeah, You're yeah. at the cookery school, what, about two or three times a week? Yeah, both that, yeah. The cattle are transported from the cookery school. They come the night before and they are arrested. The vet comes in the morning. We start the process going, but the cattle are relaxed. There's no fuss. It makes for better beef. Makes for mm. better beef. You know? It's interesting. And, and you also age it yes. for us as well. Yeah. Before, yeah. before, it, comes before it comes back, we hang it four or five weeks. The whole thing tenderizes whilst it's aging. So it all helps in the process. Just yeah. gives such lovely flavour and tenderness. And when you see that that dark colour, it's like the it's there, you know that yeah. lovely darker colour or yeah, from, from the bit of beef that I had yeah. of yours the other night. I had to cut off the end of it because it was dark and I dried yes, out yes, a little yes, bit yes, and yes, then yes. it just means it's going to be even more delicious yeah. inside and just shave that little bit off. Yeah. Oh my god. Yeah. Oh, wow, Cats 1947. Well, it was very important in those days to hang the stock outside because people walking up and down the street studied it and looked at it and uh, said, oh, that looks good stock, that looks good meat. Uh, we'd go in. They knew a lot more about mm -hmm. uh, carcasses and meat than today. There's possibly a, a young generation coming up that can't associate meat with animals, you know? Yes. You know? Yes. And um, in those days, That's they knew all about fabulous. it. Fabulous. Yep. Yeah, I like that picture up there. <laughs> 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 that was actually the cookery school. I wonder yeah. what year that's from. With Darina. Is Darina holding a tongue? A tongue. Yeah, yeah, there's yeah, an, an ox tongue. tongue. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Picture, yeah. yeah. The and class. then Kevin Ahern from Sage. Yeah, yeah. About that. Yeah. Fantastic. Yeah.